Subscribe to Cheeky Sport, visit. <laughs> subscribe. Please subscribe to Cheeky Sport and this cheeky fella here. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, got to say, I only say as I see it. Today we were fantastic, we were brilliant. If we can keep it consistently, I will even go to Wenger and say sorry at the end of the season. What team do you actually currently support, sir? Um, United. Man United. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're the wrong place, mate. <laughs> Says the Emirates over there. You know, I don't understand why we can play so well at home and then go away and go missing. I'm at Jake Wood! Jake! Oh my days, it's Jake! Oh my days! Did you kill Lucy? One of our big supporters. Oh, what was you doing down Chelsea yesterday? Man? We, we do everything. What are you doing down Chelsea? Robbie, man? we don't do everything. Listen, listen. Robbie. Don't go Chelsea. Robbie, man. I'm a Dagenham and Redbridge. <laughs> I'm a Dab Dagenham and Redbridge fan. My name is Chitty Sport Jordan. We're outside the Everett Stadium today. We're Arsenal are beating Stoke 3 0. Let's go talk to the fans today and see what they think of the result. Let's go. Uh, they've won 3-0 uh, today. Different result from last time when Charlie Adams had you in a headlock. <laughs> Tell us what you thought. Oh, it was a brilliant performance by Arsenal. Um, you know, Alexis Sanchez, amazing, what can we say? Fantastic performance by him. I, I just thought all round by the team, the way we closed down, it was, it was great, great, great to see. And I think the main difference is um, is that Stoke, when we played them away, they got that early goal that sort of set them on, you know, because we did pull two back there, but today we took the control right from the start and it was a great performance. How's it going, guys? I'm chilling with Chambers. Chambers, here, what's up? Not much, not much. Stuck, up, stuck in that? traffic, stuck in traffic. <laughs> Claude, it's always the same. You win one week, you lose the next, really. Then you get upset, all in the cameras. This is why we know you, mate. I know, but I, got to say, I only say as I see it. Today, we were fantastic, we were brilliant. If we can keep it consistently, I will even go to Wenger and say sorry at the end of the season, yeah? You heard that, Wenger. He'll apologize on your knees? Yeah, on my knees, mate. You heard it here first on Cheeky Sport, on his knees, Claude. It, how can Theo even get back in the team? I mean, you've got Ozil that you've paid the most money for, so he's definitely going to play. You've got Sanchez, you've got Ramsey when he's on fire. And he then threat's unique, though. <laughs> yeah, but so what? He's been the same for the last 10 years. He's going to have. A, he's going to be eligible for a testimonial next year. And what has he done? The only time I've seen you do well with... The only time, we you do well with, we the only time you've done well is in a community shield, right? Okay. And uh, it was a good performance. De deflected goal by Giroud, by the way, just saying. But right. besides that... All right, so you know, Tell me logically, why can't happen? Why can't what happened on the community shield happen again at the Etihad? Tell me on a logical basis why it can't happen again. Every season, it's the same thing. You don't you don't make all the right purchases. You're lacking at the back. Your midfield's weak. Sanchez is the only real threat. Ozil isn't looking like he's going to do anything. Nothing special. Nothing 42 million worth anyway. Oh no! Come on! Come on! Today! Today! Listen, today we were we were excellent, yeah. We were excellent. We could keep, keep that consistency up. I will, I will, as I say, I will, I will change my four. Listen, top four, top four. That would be, that would be good. Get top four, and we might even have a good run in the Champions League. Who knows? That never happens. Well, you never know. But then you probably next week at Man City, I might have a different idea. We but know you will. <laughs> we know you will. <laughs> oh, and uh, any special messages to the Tottenham fans? Hey. Oh well, another full storm is is uh, is is upon, is upon them, isn't it? I mean, they win a couple of games, they think they're up back, but similar to you. Yeah. Uh, no, 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 no. Please, please, look, come on. Tottenham is another level, mate. Tottenham is another level below, mate. The one thing you have to remember, it was only Stoke. It was, yeah, it was only Stoke, but I have a lot of hatred for them as well. So I need to come and see them get beat, to be honest. What they did to me last time was quite horrible. And did you feel it? Yes, yes, I did. <laughs> and are you happy you got the revenge? Yes, I did. Yeah, yeah, very, 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 very happy. Although I'm sad that Devichi got injured, but I'm happy overall with the game. He's always injured, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Would you say that Wenger has brainwashed you? No, no. Are you sure? Yeah, definitely. Do he's, I look he's like told I could, you. Do I look like I could be brainwashed? <laughs> Did he, as he, maybe. I, I, he hasn't told you to say that. No, definitely not. No. no. Oh yeah, oh, Chambers. He signed, oh, signed it. Chambers. Chambers signed it. He signed it. Oh yeah, Chambers. He signed it. Chambers. Chambers. Oh, yeah, Chambers. He signed Chambers. Chambers. Subscribe to Cheeky Sport, visit, <laughs> subscribe. And final thoughts, last time we had you, you was a bit scavy. You were like, mm, Wenger in, Wenger out. You was protecting your job at Arsenal Fan TV. Uh, we saw it, we had you on film. I've uh, never, to be, to be fair, I've never ever said to anybody that I think Wenger should be out. Um, 
you've got to give him at least till the end of the season. He, listen, he's made a lot of mistakes, definitely. No, nobody can hide that. He should have brought in a, a defensive midfielder, centre-back uh, um, in the summer. However, he's also had to manage some horrific injuries. We see with a manager like Martinez at Everton, how he's had to manage injuries and we're, we're the teams that you see with Jurgen Klopp how he's had to deal with injuries and losing both his best. Links, both links with Arsenal by the way. Yeah and that's what I'm saying and how they've managed those situations very very badly so we've got to be careful what careful we wish, what wish for. for. Careful. Careful what you wish for. <laughs> Are you allowed to say who you support? Yeah Norwich City. Norwich City? Yeah. You can go now Bill. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Thank you Jay. Quick message to Chris from Redman TV. Redman TV please. Chris. <laughs> you say cheeky sport. Ericsson, are you going to do a Gareth Bell? My name is Joel. We're here filming after the Liverpool versus Arsenal game. It was 2-2. Two -two. No. Because we know that this season is now a write-off. Oh, we've got to do. We do. We don't know what's going to happen in January. Are going to win the Champions League? What are you going to no, do? No, exactly. Arsenal are not going to win the Champions League. <laughs>